What is selenium? Selenium is a free, open source, automated testing suite for web applications across different browsers and platforms. It is quite similar to HP Unified Function Test, QTP, only that Selenium focuses on automating web-based applications. Selenium is not just a single tool, but a suite of software, each catering to different testing needs of an organization. It has four components. Selenium Integrated Development Environment, IDE, Selenium Remote Control, RC, WebDriver, and Selenium Grid. At the moment, Selenium RC and WebDriver are merged into a single framework to form Selenium 2. Selenium 1, by the way, refers to Selenium RC. Who developed Selenium? Since Selenium is a collection of different tools, it had different developers as well. Following are the key persons who made notable contributions to the Selenium project. Primarily, Selenium was created by Jason Huggins in 2004. An engineer at ThoughtWorks, he was working on a web application that required frequent testing. Having realized that the repetitious manual testing of their application was becoming more and more inefficient, he created a JavaScript program that would automatically control the browser's actions. He named this program as the JavaScript Test Runner. Seeing potential in this idea to help automate other web applications, he made JavaScript Runner open source, which was later renamed as Selenium Core. The Same Origin Policy Issue same origin policy prohibits JavaScript code from accessing elements from a domain that is different from where it launched. Example, the HTML code in www.google.com uses a JavaScript program randomscript.js. The same origin policy will only allow randomscript.js to access pages within google.com, such as google.com slash mail, google.com slash login, or google.com slash signup. However, it cannot access pages from different sites such as yahoo.com slash search or guru99.com because they belong to different domains. Birth of Selenium Remote Control, Selenium RC. Unfortunately, Testers using the Selenium Core had to install the whole application under test and the web server on their own local computers because of the restrictions imposed by the same origin policy. So another ThoughtWorks engineer, Paul Hammett, decided to create a server that will act as an HTTP proxy to trick the browser into believing that Selenium Core and the web application being tested come from the same domain. This system became known as the Selenium Remote Control, or Selenium 1. Birth of Selenium Grid Selenium Grid was developed by Patrick Lightbody to address the need of minimizing test execution times as much as possible. He initially called the system Hosted QA. It was capable of capturing browser screenshots during significant test stages and also of sending out Selenium commands to different machines simultaneously. Birth of Selenium IDE Shinya Kasatani of Japan created Selenium IDE, a Firefox extension that can automate the browser through a record and playback feature. He came up with this idea to further increase the speed in creating test cases. He donated Selenium IDE to the Selenium project in 2006. Birth of WebDriver Simon Stewart created WebDriver around 2006 when browsers and the web applications were becoming more powerful and more restrictive with JavaScript programs like Selenium Core. It was the first cross-platform testing framework that could control the browser from the OS level. Birth of Selenium 2 in 2008, the whole Selenium team decided to merge WebDriver and Selenium RC to form a more powerful tool called Selenium 2, with WebDriver being the core. 
Currently, Selenium RC is still being developed, but only in maintenance mode. Most of the Selenium project's efforts are now focused on Selenium 2. In the next tutorial, we will get our hands dirty with Selenium.